Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the DZMC Gaming Channel. I actually just, on a whim, just took my turn in the Friday Night game. Just on a whim, just came in here, and it looks like Devier is taking his turn. Nine infantry, two. He's okay, so he's buying that. One transport. You don't need any more. You got enough. Nine, ten, eleven. There we go in there. Only four are coming back, though. But then you'll have 12. Maybe. That'd be interesting. Well, I'm only recording this because I, uh, some of my subscribers want to see any kind of battles. And there is a chance that the Americans go first. Not likely, but there's a chance. Like I said, unlikely, but they might. I also want to get rid of this message here. This is not. This isn't necessary, um, because uh, there is a chance that he could also come in and take that before I even get to there. So I can defend here with this just by taking Rome this turn. He's got, he's got no tanks, can't blitz through or anything, so. So that's that. Purchase phase, huh? What, no more bombers? Ugh. He's got to deal with this. He doesn't like that. Put two guys here, maybe. I guess what I got on here. Got two. That's good. So I'll have my choice of where to put these guys next turn. He's, he's doing some math. He's got to be. And there's a lot to do. <laughs> this I know. Still curious why he left that carrier up there like that. Down to the nitty gritty. Forget what the odds were here. I think I gave him uh, a 22, 28% chance maybe on this. But then if it doesn't go well, it's over here in Moscow. And actually, you know, I don't even mind the British have Rome, too. They have France and Rome. So the Americans are just, like, stuck transporting guys. The British own all the cool stuff. I don't care what happens, just shoot down this bomber. Hmm. He does, he 
does take his time. Don't really think you need the other transport. Turn down uh, ambient sound. That's better. Something like that. Come on, let's get the game done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Can go in here. Can't do that. You're leaving these guys alone. <laughs> you can't go in here. You can't even go in with the British first. So if the UK attack. We should be left with between 13 and 16 infantry left and all the other stuff. Then I'll be able to get all these planes back. So that's adding four more plus eight more. That's 12. Then the Americans have to hit it. I don't envy them at all on that one. It's like I said, it's like a 1.8% chance. And if he gets that result, then tip my hat to you, buddy. You deserve it. Got to remember to kill this. That's important. Because if not, he can let his planes there bind you. Now we don't want him to. I think I might even buy another AA gun here. I have 41 to spend. Maybe AA gun, fighter, and uh, aid infantry, something like that. infantry or seven infantry artillery don't go offline don't go offline all right well i'll pause it here if i if i hear some movement folks i'll uh because i don't want you guys to just watch this dead air stuff while he's thinking he's probably doing calculations in the background which i would be doing so let's pause it here um and we'll come back when he actually starts to take a turn so hang with us stay with me Okay, folks, so he's uh, into combat move phase. He bought less than I thought. Okay. What did he buy the sub for? Um, what? Uh, he might be coming back here. That's fine. Let's go here. I'll take this side. He'll be able to take one of the money islands. That's it. Seven and two. That's nine. Ten, eleven. He's bringing all these guys. He's bringing four back. Plus another transport, which can't, well, I guess it could reach. So five transports. So 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I guess that works out somewhat. The 8 transports doesn't. He's got to He's got to bite the bullet. Not here, obviously, but he's got, somewhere down the line, he's got to bite the bullet and mix these up so there's like six guys going at a time. I wonder if he's going to send any guys up here. He's got no combat moves anyway, so just... Um, bombing strafe. That's it. Or strategic bombing run. Hopefully me watching it will kill it. <laughs> Schrodinger's box. Schrodinger's cat, I should say, in the box. There might be some truth to that, actually, on a quantum level. But that's a different discussion. I wonder if he's going to bring this plane. That'll be a clear indicator to me. 
Um, if he wants to bring his plane down somewhere, then he's definitely going next turn, which I think he is, but still. But if he moves this plane, it's in danger, and he knows it. Because I could take it. I could forego this. Probably won't, but I could to take Moscow. I have to calculate that. So there's that. So, yeah. very deliberate. So what happens? It's not going to hit. Yeah, of course not. One. Ha! Nice. I'll take that. I could do one. Although it does kind of screw up what I wanted to buy. It gives me 40 now. Eh. I can still buy the plane. Maybe two tanks? Two tanks, eight infantry? Two tanks, seven infantry, and artillery? So he's not going up here. Okay. I thought there was a chance he might. Remember, I calculated this plane, these two planes, in that fight. I calculated everything, even these three planes. But now these three planes are actually out of that fight. They can't hit this turn around 12. So the odds are actually better than what I calculated. And even what, what I calculated, he had a 1.8% chance to take it with the UK and a American, a US 1-2. <clears throat> but I included everything. He's going to bombard the hell out of me, though, next turn. Oh, he's oh he's pulling him down here. Okay. They can reach down. One, two, three. Okay. So he's going to pull these guys up. So he's definitely not attacking this now, because he would have needed those two planes as defense. And he's not trading any of these either. So that's good news. He might get this. Let's let him make his moves. I'm going to go smoke a cigarette. I'll be right back, folks. Just going to pause it here. Okay, and we are back. And Oh, you even took his Russian turn. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Um, well, we know what the Americans did. Yeah, tank blitz. So that's it. Okay, well, we'll repair that. By that... So he's obviously showing no desire to take this, clearly. Again, we don't want to leave a landing spot for his fighters, but if we did... Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Not have a landing spot here, so we have to take this. So we might build one for here or for Corellia. Probably Corellia. And we're going to leave this because we want the Japanese to take it. Or maybe we'll take it. I don't know. Maybe we'll take it. I think we're going to take one shot here at uh, Rome. One guy. Just so we can't build there. So air, repaired, and let's go. Take this. Picking up three. It's thirty eight. If I get this. Um. Yeah, we'll grab it. We'll grab it. The one bomber is actually not going to make it. We're going to land him. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, four, five, six, maybe. Will he be vulnerable there? Yes, he would be. Um, yeah, I don't think, I don't think that one bomber is going to make a difference here. So let's make him useful. Now he's hit me back like three straight times now on these, so I'm going to delay it a little bit. Hopefully that helps right about here. Ah, got it. That was a big get. Let's be another big get. Hit on the infantry would be nice. Always. Pretty good. Again, to attack this, he has to, he can't use four planes here. And he wants to, so I'll move it along. What did I build? Oh, I forgot to build the AA gun. Damn it. I knew it. This guy's going down. This guy's staying here. You still got a good lead on me. Thirty point lead. But again, I think it's all mostly in planes. So this is the big battle right here, folks. That's what we're going to see. That's what we all came to pay. That's what we all paid for.
so excited. Now this is where he also decides whether or not he's going to come into here. And a transport. Built the transport over here. In the water, not the water. Be a sneaky little move. You go for a uh, eight nine, sneaky little attack on the Philippines or something like that. That's what he's hoping for. Oh, he went offline. No. Oh, come on, dude. Debbie, hey, you got bad timing, man. I serious. Oh man. Wow, that's awful. Let's go time. Let's go time. Do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, as Bill Burr would say. I don't have the numbers on this. I mean, I do if I had my tanks, but it means it depends how bad. I mean, if, if how badly the UK, if, if I'm left with 20 infantry left, um, I'm good. I might be able to use some of these tanks. I mean, 20 infantry after the UK uh, battle. Assuming he'll hit 15. Because I think he'll be annihilated on the first round of combat. So he's got one, he's got basically a one round strafe on Berlin. Now he could choose to wait another turn, but that wouldn't help him either. He's only got two guys that can come. See, these dark skies by uh, Germany, I, I like it, you know, early, especially early on. It prevents the fleet from splitting up, where they could be really effective as the allies. But we've been able to manage to hang on. I mean, how, when do you ever see a KGF in round 12 where Germany has Norway and Finland and Karelia? Like, that's usually not the case 99% of the time. Anyway, got some exciting news. Uh, Shake and I, I think I mentioned this. Shake and I uh, just finished our turn, um, the Allies' turn, in our game against uh, Air Dolphin and Vagabond in our Friday Night Blitz number two. And I know a lot of you have been waiting to see how that finishes up. We haven't forgotten about it. We just, I guess, real life got in the way for everybody. And we finally got, well, we were able to get together tonight and uh, shake an eye and strategize. But uh, I think you're going to be pleasantly surprised. We actually have, uh, well, I don't want to give it away because they might be watching this video. <laughs> so <laughs> can't even talk about it. <coughs> and then, of course, got our uh, custom game with Mannix coming up. I'm really super excited about that. I've uh, been kind of a, uh, I would say hero of mine, but like he was definitely one of the guys early on that I really paid attention to, really picked up on his style of uh, commentary and just the content that he provides and his uh, little uh, euphemisms, you know, <laughs> just the way he talks and stuff. It's it's funny, but not in like I'm laughing at you kind of way, just like I'm a chuckling along with you kind of way. So that's kind of cool. Looking forward to that match. 
he's definitely way better than he used to be. Actually, we both are. Well, you know, I was going to give him a little bit of time, but now he's going to wait till like 4 o'clock in the morning. Take his turn. Maybe he's teasing the crowd. <laughs> like a teaser. <laughs> Tune in next week. Problem is, we want to watch the battle. I do. Here we're going to be okay. Uh, he might decide to move out or uh, or build. Like you said, we, he could build here and try to threaten the fleet. He's only got one transport with him this time, so it's not that big a deal, and it's very easy to answer to. So. I think I need to build at least one destroyer, too. Might need to build more than that. Might even need to build here. Maybe two planes. Cause these guys are going to be needed here. So we're going to add four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's what we're adding. Might have been sent two off, two tanks. We'll see. We don't have to take Moscow yet. We just got to make sure Berlin is safe. Moscow's not, or the Russians aren't doing anything. And if we do get here with this, without him being there, uh, we'll effectively dead zone Persia as well. So what are we collecting as the, uh, what's the score? Oh, yeah. Collecting 40, although that's going to change. Well, no, he's not going to strap bomb me. He's going to use his bombers. So we can still build a fighter and nine infantry next turn. If we get there. Against whatever he builds here. He'll have no planes left. And possibly no transports because I can kill his fleet. Come on, David. Come on, Lion. Well, you know, I'm not going well, I'm sitting here bubbling up thinking, you know, it's just like I would normally do. I forget that I'm actually recording. <laughs> Sorry, folks. I'm gonna pause it here though, because I think he might come back online. I think he understands. He's a subscriber, so he watch his videos too. I think he would like to see that battle. Um, at least I hope that's his mentality. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll pause it here. But if he doesn't, for some crazy reason, um, hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and feel free to share this video with my permission. And But we are, we are going to pause, so stay with us. Okay, folks, we're back. It's like getting pretty late. Divi, in all honesty, he did message me through Discord and say that he needs to take his time on this. Um, just don't blame him. But he's got to go now. If he doesn't go now, he won't be able to. So, um, I think maybe he's thinking about coming down here or something. I don't know. I can defend that. It's not going to be like last time. And I can defend this without these four planes. These four planes are bonus. They don't need to be there. Um, but it'd be nice to have them there. Uh, so we'll call it a turn. Hit the like button, subscribe, and hit the notifications bell. And feel free to share these videos with my permission. And I believe Devier is okay with that too. So uh, thanks for watching, folks. And we'll see you on uh, Japan's round 12 turn. Thanks for watching.